You hate the agenda. You hate the agenda. You just no. want to fucking. No, I'm giving you the opportunity. We're starting on Jalen Brown. So I want to know. I'm asking you directly why Jalen Brown is upset. I don't started? exactly know. Did we start? I don't we're exactly live. know. We're live. Oh, well, what says we're live. I, whatever room. I, I did not say we're live. If producer Reese says we're live, then I guess we're fucking live. Producer Reese runs this goddamn show. Thursday, March twenty third, twenty twenty three. We got no. We got no B rider. We got no. We got no bear. We got no Tony Batista. Tony Batista was body bagging Tavis in the fucking Discord, and no, Tavis did nothing to defend no, himself. It was sad. It was sad. He wasn't. He wasn't. He got smoked. He wasn't. Tavis got okay. smoked. Tony Batista throwing the throwing the picture, throwing the picture of Tony Batista with a little, uh, you know, I'm the shit. We you gotta get a picture of Tony Batista with him the shit there. Hey, how about, um, how about no, it's fine. No, Tavis, Tavis, Tavis didn't want to you know talk about you know just trying to trying to continue to build on the biggest biggest radio program in all of San Francisco right now. And Ti doesn't doesn't want to be a you know be, oh, be a constructive what? constructive team member here. Okay. So it's just sad. It's it's sad to see we're we're investing in Ti. Dang. We're sad. investing in, in the in the in the gambling vertical. Uh, producer Reese putting a lot of his putting a lot of his eggs in that basket. You know, uh, and I appreciate it, Reese. Reese and I are on a text message basis, but I, we're starting with Jalen Brown. <laughs> And you don't want to talk about Jalen Brown, so why write the agenda if you don't want to answer the question of why he's upset? That's how I'm I don't know why he's upset, Tavis. That's why we're fucking talking yeah, about it. Well, I can the, the daily the Daily Mail, according to I think who was it last time that pulled it up? Someone pulled it up on the last show. You wanted to disregard it. I'll pull it up now. But I don't have pull screen it up sharing. now. I don't have screen sharing purposes, so I can't. It's kind of like useless for me to pull it up. But let's what am I, see. What am I it's sad, up? really. What am I pulling up? It's sad. Producer Reese, producer Reese is uh, wants to be a contributor here. Tavis needs a rival. He says he needs a rival. Dang. He says that I'm not fit to be Tavis's rival. I think he's probably right. I just don't have the the energy to go tit for tat with Ti on a, on a on a on a play by play basis. I'm more of the overseer, the strategic overlay, if you will. I can, so uh, I can... uh, you know, it, it's things things are rough all over for our guy Ti. Things are rough all over. I'm 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 a little sad. I'm praying. In what for regard? I just won FAU. You're only as good as your last bet. I lost the video. We keep losing on the videos, but I I won the last bet. So. But we don't have a That's block, facts. so I have no way of getting anything <laughs> I ever fix on unless I fucking go walk to get a cold brew and film it. So, is there any update there? Yeah, that's a good that's a good question. Uh, yeah, we're 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 working on that. We're working on that. I have a call with uh, Devnest 2.0, Devnest Ezzy. If you want to hit up Devnest Ezzy, he is in the Discord at E Z Y at Ezzy, and uh, I think you should blow up his spot. I think you should say, "Hey, Devnest Ezzy, I think we're waiting on the blog. I think I'll blow up. We got to get it going too. here. Yeah, no, I think. I'll yeah, blow I think up. I think we got to hit up Devnest Ezzy. Okay, and say, yeah. I mean, come on, well, Desi. where's the like blog? A month already, man. <laughs> If I had a blog, I would have got, like, okay, I got my video. I mean, like, after I did some more fucking, after things started tilting, I would have said, hey, quick blog post, FAU plus four and a half, the, the get back spot, get even for tomorrow. So that's what happened, and that's great. Get it right and get it back. Get it right and get it back. Tavis doesn't want to talk about Aaron Rodgers and the fact that. What about Aaron Rodgers? O- He's overpaying. Well, I don't even know if that trade is going to go through anymore. That's what I'm curious about. Um, is he a jet? I don't think he's a jet at this point, Tavis. And the fact that he had his weird wish list that was like everyone from that was good in 2013. Like he's just 10 years behind the eight ball. I mean, Randall Cobb and him are like boys. I like, guess it's good to have your boys there. But I just thought that there it was a pretty curious wish list. I think it was well, Randall so Cobb. Here, yeah, uh, I mean, here's a conspiracy. Mar- Mercedes story. Lewis. Mercedes Lewis, who's been in the NFL for 20 years. He's I mean, this so is unbelievable. Crazy. He's an unbelievable, unbelievable. Just, just specimen of an athlete. I mean, he's he has to like, be uh, up there. He's like a mashed potato and meatloaf kind of guy. He's not gonna like. When you get a Michelin star, but he's pretty solid. He had a good year last year, did he not? I mean, like the Jags in the playoffs, right? He's still on the Jags. Yeah. Well, no, he was no, he was on the no. the Packers last year. Oh, uh, was he? I think he was. Yeah. I mean, I, I remember he was super old when the Jags and uh, the boat Blake Bortles played in Foxborough seven years ago. I thought that the Packers brought. Did they bring back Randall Cobb or am I crazy? They did. That's what I'm saying. So he wants Randall Cobb, Mercedes Lewis, yeah, and yeah, like yeah. Odell Beckham at the Jets, and well, he's I, already I didn't forty. Know Mercedes Lewis was on the Packers though last year. I, I knew Randall Cobb was, but I didn't know that. Yeah. Well. I don't know. Here's a conspiracy theory. Is Aaron Rodgers just doing this because he knows the price is too high for New York and he just wants the Packers to release him so he can, like, truly pick where he wants to go? See, that's what I'm talking about. I don't know. Well, where else would he go? Who, who wants him? Would, would the Niners take him right now? I don't think so. Yeah, probably, to be honest. You think? A thousand percent, yeah. I, I like, I'm not saying I want him, but would they do that? Yeah. There's you some know? rumors that the Niners reached out to Big Ben at the end of last year. I don't know what you think about those rumors, but. Uh, I didn't hear that, but I, I've never heard that one. I've heard about, I mean, they, they, they called on draft day about Rogers, the Trey Lance draft. Yeah. So I don't know. So how, that, how would that work then? So, so he gets, tra- so he gets let would, go by, the but Packers. He, he needs to be traded. He can't get, they're not just going to let him out of his contract. Can't be, I right? mean, they could in theory, right? I think they both sides have made it pretty clear that they don't want to like, they're moving on. I mean, the Packers, yeah. unless they pull the Jimmy G, like. The, the like all right guys like it's been fun i mean he comes back next year but i, I think it's more of it <laughs> i feel like they've done that like three times with jimmy g joe montana at the end of the year was like we gotta bring back jimmy g 
<laughs> now he's gone. That's... Oh, it's over. Gonzaga just hit a fucking dagger. It's a six point game. Unbelievable. So the Zags get it done. The West Coast Conference represent, man. West Coast Conference. Love to see that. Uh, Speaking of other, so yeah, I mean, it's, it's a big week for big name quarterbacks. Jimmy G is down in Las Vegas. He's getting free, uh, free escort services left and right. I don't see the Raiders going more than six and eleven with with Jimmy G in uh, in Reno every other weekend uh, at uh, you know producer Reese's sex club extraordinaire. What do you think on our boy Jimmy G there, producer Reese? Yeah, they got Jimmy rid of G. Darren Waller too. Yeah, I like. They that. got rid of Darren Waller as well. They need they need more debauchery. Darren Waller wasn't bringing them enough debauchery. Well, Since he's gone sober now, good for him. Hey, I'm happy drugs. for him. Good for him. But they need a, they need some Jimmy G debauchery in their lives. Josh McDaniels, I love it. Producer Reese, what do you got on Jimmy G? Jimmy G, um, I love the guy. You know, what's not to love about him? You know, um, whatever. T- Fun fact: Tony Batista is a Raiders fan. So yeah, yeah. No, I think Tony Batista is actually a, a Chiefs fan. If I'm not mistaken, right? Mm. He's a Raiders fan who was yeah. playing a Chiefs fan against Bear. Yeah. And then he was talking shit about Tavis in the Discord. Yeah. And his betting. What was he saying then, to you, Tavis, uh, in the Discord? It was yeah, crazy, man. He was, he was messages. Man, what was he, apparently, what was he, he was. What was he saying, Dan? I saw him. He was, he, was, he, was, he was blowing some people up. He was blowing. He was blowing you up, producer Reese. He said producer Reese was too soft at right. the company retreat on Saturday. I mean, he wasn't even there. Like, what kind of performance is that? It's kind of a poor performance. He said he didn't show. Yeah. He was disappointed. Yeah. He was disappointed a lot. I mean, I, disappointed I, a lot of people. I, 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 Jimmy G, I expect today. a big year. How, from Jimmy how, Jimmy how much? What? What is Aaron Rodgers' contract? Is it, is it all guaranteed? It's like fifty million plus all guaranteed? a year. I, I don't know, dude. I don't know. What the the, the quarterback market right now is bananas. That's why I want to talk about Lamar Jackson too. It's so inflated. No, I don't. But like, if they were like, we'll, we'll cut him. Like, if it's not guaranteed, do they are they on the hook for his salaries? I don't know how this shit works. I like cap and all that. I don't understand. So I well, I, I think it's like a friend. Yeah, no, it's a good question. They're all structured differently. But then there's like yeah. you can't cut him. But then it's like it's you got to pay him a certain amount once it hits like the new league year. And then it's also like the dead cap issue too. It's so it's like book. okay, yeah, that that makes sense, right? It's like the Packers cut him. Like they have to pay him plus like they lose that cap space, right? It's not exactly. Like, yeah. That's what that's what I don't exactly know the full ins and outs on. I think it's like pretty interesting, but that's a huge hit, obviously, especially dude. And then dude, again, I don't want to keep bringing it back to the Patriots and Bill Belichick and Tom Brady, but why can't these guys figure out? That figure it. The fact that Tom Brady didn't take like the most money every single year and have the biggest contract, one of the most inflated contracts, was a huge part of the Patriots' success for twenty plus years. I don't, I don't understand why that's like a foreign concept to everyone. Um, I love, but I hey. don't know. Mahomes is one too, being pretty well paid. That's true, it's and uh, he's, he's, he's making pretty what? Pretty big Mahomes guy, you know. Maybe she get a he is a Mahomes guy. Mahomes, but but Mahomes even that he's even he's going to be priced out of his contract in like a, a two years. If not, you can make the argument that he already is. He's making what four hundred fifty million for fifteen years. So Deshaun that's like thirty Watson million a year, right? Him. He's not even making. He's Deshaun not, Watson fucked everything up. Yeah, we'll bring it up to our next guy, Lamar Jackson. He, now Lamar Jackson thinks he's like a two hundred fifty guaranteed guy, he and can't that's stay totally healthy. yeah. I don't. That messes up. That messes up everything because what's his name about two thirty guaranteed after getting you know rubbing tugs for like six straight years. Uh, from so, like like Robert Kraft. Hey man, you know I I don't hate him for the the well I think it's like Robert Kraft is you know if, if you're getting a, a rub and tug that's uh, that's one thing if you're assaulting your your masseuses what have you and kind of pressuring and uh, putting women you know again these are uh, I don't want to uh, speak out of turn here no but um that was uh, yeah, I have no comment on that one but you know we don't like to see sexual assault I don't know what the you know producer used to have us I can't speak for YouTube but uh, you know at OneTakeMedia.com we do not support yeah. sexual assault um, I'm anti violence bro anti anti sexual assault you know. Very good. Now the producers know. Ever, ever since Nailed the, uh, yeah, the, was it Jordan Poole, you know, the whole, you know, with the Warriors, you know, we're anti, right. anti violence. But before that, before that, you were like yeah. on the fence on violence. You were like, hey, you know, maybe right. violence is good, maybe it's bad. Did I say it? That? It seemed like it. But then after that, that was a violent event, and we just don't want to see any more violence yeah. from our, uh, from, 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 especially with San hey, Francisco s- teams. Sorry, sorry, from to guys like Draymond sorry Green. To so anyway, the Lamar Jackson contract, go for it, Tavis. Yep. Uh, sorry. Gonzaga is out rebounding UCLA. 46 to 24. How were they just ever down 13 off that? Alone? Offensively and defensively? Yeah, just total like, rebounds. Total rebounds. That's, how does it even happen? They're, how, they're plus 22. How were they ever down 13? I didn't watch the first half of this game. I don't know. I didn't watch, I'm, not, I'm just watching in, in the background talking about the Lamar Jackson contract and how he's, yeah, right. apparently he's got, there's, there's some guy that's like going around saying he represents Lamar Jackson. <laughs> Did you see that? No, what? No, I know, but there was a guy that NFL put out like a memo. That like don't listen to this guy named like Jimmy Smith. He had some like outrageously like just just <laughs> plain Jane that? name. That was very funny. Why didn't we? Think uh, that? Yeah, I know we should have sent hey you know Reese Wong yeah, Esquire yeah, out representing uh, representing Reece Wong Esquire <laughs> representing Lamar Jackson. That would be outstanding. Hey Reese Wong Esquire Esquire uh, coming in next weekend. Yeah. But 
I mean, that contract, I don't know where he goes as far as the market is concerned. It seems like a ton of teams are out of him already. I mean, he's he had a sick 2019, and the last three years, he won one playoff game, won one wild card game, and what have they gone? Like 10 and 7, uh, maybe 11 and 6 one year, TI? Yeah, but I, I, don't I just know don't see it for. Either. I don't know. No one knows what his health is. That's like the big thing is like, hey, what's up with his knee? He short arms it. That's the thing. He short arms it with his throw. He doesn't have a great natural like throwing motion. That's what I worry about with Mac Jones too. I Mac buy Jones. into the narrative that Lamar. J- I mean, his team fucking sucks. Like he has no help. It's not that he can't throw. He can throw, but he has like a very quick. He's here with it. Like the guys that can really. Like, you got to get that C shape on your on your throwing motion. That's what I worry about with Mac Jones. Bailey Zappi has it. Uh, Brock Purdy has an outstanding C shape throwing motion. He has an outstanding C shape. Even Jimmy G's got a nice. Uh, Nice, nice, full, complete motion with range there. So, uh, Lamar, hey, I, I don't, I don't have any predictions. Producer, Reese, you got any predictions on where he's going to end up? I don't see him back in Baltimore. Now he's just a headache in Baltimore. What, what are you going to do? We're talking about he's not uh, going to get paid. He's not going to get what he wants from Baltimore. But I know, but, even, but now it's like now he's under like some weird uh, what you gonna call it? Uh, yeah, what did uh, they put on him? It was like the, like it's like a non conditional franchise tag or some yeah, shit. So like yeah. he has to play there next year, and they're just going to keep doing this dance. I and mean, he's only twenty six. It's like he's like good enough to where it's like, oh, what are you going to just start from scratch? I mean, you're gonna, he's like a he's like a ten maybe eleven win guy, um, but that yeah, I don't know, I don't I, know for, for for the Ravens. So. Maybe he'll sit I, out. I just don't see them as a real threat. Yeah, he might sit out. He could. That would make sense. Yeah, maybe he'll start playing for the Patriots. You know, that's what I think. What do you think, Dan? Yeah, zero <laughs> percent chance. Yeah, Lamar Reese, Jackson for the Pats. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Bad, bad take. I, even I can't get behind that Reese. I, uh, yeah, I, I wish Lama Jackson. He, he and Belichick are boys. He and Belichick like each other a lot. He, yeah, he, uh, they, uh, yeah, yeah. I've been, so I've been, I've been really anti Lamar anything. for a really long time because he's fucked me over so many times. Like I bet on him and he just like absolutely like, gives it to me. But I'm really, yeah. cool. I like to call him Lama Jackson. I just take the R off his name. Um, and I call him that all the time. So I'm rooting for Llama. I like him. I like how he wears his sunglasses on the sideline. I think that's funny. Um, and uh, I hope he goes somewhere where he gets some help and he gets some weapons. Uh, UCLA has completely crumbled. Um, Mark Few. It's sad. These, these West Coast, the West Coast schools, yeah. I mean, like, who are the preeminent programs out West right now? It's not Arizona. Arizona exactly. has not been a preeminent program for 20 years. Gonzaga is pretty much the only one that I can think of, Producer East. Who else you got? Hmm. I mean, UCLA is like been in a tournament, and like, I mean, Gonzaga's the best. West but like, uh, but like a real threat to win the tournament. That's what I, that's what I, you kind of get a feel for teams guy, coming in. Guy, their best defender like towards Achilles in the Pac-12 final. I don't know if you saw that. It was like, yeah. like towards non-contact, like towards Achilles. They're all banged up. Um, they could have been, but not like consistently recently. And that's your point. I think you're, yeah, I think you're going off a lot of like mid to early 2000 kind of basketball, like who the top dogs are. And exactly. Kind of that's that's that. where I base a lot of my that's where I base a lot of my logic from. Fair. So I think yeah, you and I just have a fundamental disagreement there. Yeah, I'm a big I, like I'm a big like perennial program guy. You're more like who's the team right now? Yeah, I mean, well, because that's what we're, yeah. we're talking about is right now. I mean, there are but I, I, like, there's significant value in a in a real deal program that is like a well, not what, just what a is, powerhouse, but what, a team that you know is going to be a threat. Okay, like so a UConn is like so clear the that they're going they, to be a threat. The championship was it 2012, right or 10? UConn? Yes. 2014. 2014. And they won it. They won it. Yes. So, so eight years. Yes. Okay. Eight years. That's fine. Nine okay. years. Nine. What about Kentucky? Oh, sorry. It's 2023. When's the last time Kentucky's been in the final? So it's a, not about necessarily. Blue it's it's, blue it's ball, not right? just about. It's not just about the blue. It's like okay, but who who can you see that has true momentum? Like when they get hot, they get hot. And UConn is like a clearly one of those teams. They, they had like they had two. They had like three really good runs. Right. Four. Three. Four. They had three really good runs. Okay. And then outside of that, just they don't let the- UConn get hot. That's all I'm saying. I was Why just trying to give you some easy money earlier UConn? today. I was just trying to help you out earlier today. I mean, it was the clearest bet in the history of bets that well, they were going to just smash ticket? Arkansas. Wait, they were going to smash you Arkansas. If you I'm not. Fucking, if it's so easy, you're our head of gambling content. You're our head of gambling content. Pay Reese. Yeah, you could pay Reese's fucking salary. You're ahead of you're ahead of gambling content. You're ahead of fucking gambling content. All I was saying, and I wasn't even talking about gambling in that regard. But I was just saying that, like, you can tell who the the, the, the programs are that are really threats to win. Coming in. Is Texas one of those programs? I would say not. Baylor, yes. Baylor fucking lost to Creighton, who you just said is a nobody. So what are we talking about? <laughs> it's not about this team, like, no, right it's, now. It's, 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 about the, it's about the program. It's Baylor, about the program, Tavis. Yeah, you should just take, up, you should just take over the gambling content, Dan. It's about the program. 
in college basketball, in college and sports, Baylor, and even Baylor, in pro sports. It's about the program. It's about the system, and, the program, and, and so you rank the program. Baylor as a perennial powerhouse is what you're saying. I didn't say they're a perennial powerhouse. You just but at said this Baylor's point, one of them over Texas. <laughs> at this moment in time, I would take Baylor over Texas, over Creighton. Creighton, I don't believe in Creighton. At this moment over in time, Xavier. At this moment in time, it doesn't matter, Reese. So what the fuck are we talking? I don't understand what UCLA, we're not at this time. UCLA was. They could get there in the future. I don't believe in them right now. Maybe when they had Aaron Aflalo, when they had Russell Westbrook, they were pretty good. Now, Jaime Jaquez. 2007 or 2008. So what, I don't, right, I don't understand up. what we're talking about. Last up. Uh, I guess a couple last ups. Uh, World Baseball Classic. We don't have the rider here. I, have nothing I think to he say might have to. Than. It shouldn't be on in the fucking bar during the fucking round of 32 in the tournament. Yeah, I don't disagree with you there. I don't be better here. They we got to be better too. here, San Francisco. Uh, baseball fucking stinks, dude. It stinks. Are we it's not a day. Yeah, I, I, I think. I think. Day for the Giants. Day? Are you gonna I, go? I think. Go? I think Tavis just. I think Tavis just kind of hit might, the nail on the head. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, you should go too. You know. I, can't, I mean, I'm, I'm if we gonna, come, gonna, dude, I definitely want to do Red Sox versus uh, when Red Sox come to town because Red Sox come to town like once every four years, like uh, to San Francisco. They usually well, come out to I'll Oakland to once a year. I'll go to that. When I, I would, lo- I would go to that. I, I mean, dude, I'm not going to cover the Giants. I'm not. If Red Rhino, if I could get in touch with fucking Red Rhino, I'd fund. <laughs> Producer Reese and Red Rhino to go out to fucking opening day. And, you know, Red Rhino reporting live with OneTakeMedia.com. He's probably going to give me some fucking outrageous contract like he tried to give Portnoy uh, back in the day. He, he sold 10 sweaters and fucking asked Portnoy for, like, 250K, he like, advancement. Into oblivion. Into oblivion. But, uh, yeah, that was... When the Red Sox come? I'll go to that. I mean, we're... End of July. Okay, yeah, I'm down for that. That's great. I hope it's a week, a night game. Or a weekend. Yeah, I think I think they're coming Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Oh, I would go to that saying. Sunday day game. That'd be a lot of fun. Or, or Saturday, yeah. Saturday's a day game. But I, I see that being Sunday night baseball. So I bet Saturday will be a day game. Um, I would definitely go to that. That would be fun. I, I yeah. honestly do make make it to the rooting for the Red Sox. I'm out on the Giants fully this year. They fucking stink. Dang. They are Dang. horrible. Like I'm not. Dang. I mean, I'm still, I guess, a fan. But like, I'm not. If you think I mean, they're going to get an ounce really. of my energy, I'm, it's not going to happen. Mm. Hey, you see it. Yeah, I don't really care. I, I want Cap. I, I'd like Kapler to be fired, and also I want my Farhan. Shohei Otani coming to probably one of our two teams. Yeah. Probably the Sox will give him. I yeah, can see the Sox. There's going to be a sweepstakes. It's it's going to be I don't know wherever he wants to play. I think there's a larger based on some of the comments that are going around Boston. I think the market's better for him in San Francisco, uh, regardless of the comments around Boston. But I think just in general, like, there's a huge Asian American population. Better Asian American yeah. community in uh, in San Francisco. That's 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 true. Bear, bear, watch, watch him go to like the fucking Dodgers. I I can totally see that. He's just gonna go to the fucking move up to five and go to the fucking Dodgers. Timmy yeah. is Timmy is bleeding. A minute fourteen left. UCLA is at the line shooting and one about to be. Done this is quite a debacle, man. Unbelievable from UCLA. It's sad yeah. to see. Nineteen to point see. swing in the second half. Yikes. You hate to see it. You hate to see it. All right, one take radio. We didn't even do an intro. But one take radio, March twenty third in the books. That yeah, that was, a, uh, that was probably our best episode. Yeah, we didn't even have an intro. I think maybe, I maybe we see the rolling star moving forward. I didn't even the, know. Uh, yeah. did, you, did you record audios or no? No, my phone's dead. I apologize. You actually didn't record audio. That's sad. This is going to be – oh, T.I.'s going to have bad audio. He wasn't even focused on the, the game. That's bad. What are you talking about? Is my, my audio has never been – Reese, how many times have you like used the audio I've sent you? Whenever you send it. I, I feel, use it. Yeah. Oh, that's yeah. a bad bit. Yeah, this could potentially be really bad. We may have to just scrap this one. Dang. I didn't know it was that. I didn't know it was that big of a difference. No, it's a significant difference. Yeah, okay, it's really. I, I it's honestly didn't know that, and so I will take full accountability for that. That's that's a that's something that's my fault. Producer, do you have any words for Tavis? I mean, it's sad. Accountability is what we like here at OneTakeMedia.com. Um, I mean, no, I'm definitely. That's a charge, brother. Oh wow, good day. I got bailed out. Um, no, I mean, I'm sad. accountable. I I didn't know it was that bad. <laughs> I thought with like headphones and a, a good computer, it was just kind of like a backup. But um, moving forward, we're gonna have to find a way to uh, yeah film ourselves and like get the audio ourselves too though like because yeah this Zoom 720p isn't it we gotta we gotta upgrade at some point like Dan said yeah we gotta upgrade at some point yeah we'll see if we can make some investments going into into Q2 here yeah, uh, last couple that? things last couple things sorry go ahead Tim. how would we even do that how would that work it would just be like a podcast. But it yeah, we each get like our own kind of yeah not not async no we would <laughs> we would just need like separate video filters like Tavis has a video filter like like similar to how you have how you have audio now like it'd be a, a video situation and then we can like sync all of those up into yeah. one final thing yeah 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 something like that like we'd also be so, on zoom but we'd also have like a camera here at some i think i think that's how it works oh god something like that. i understand because the, the yeah i mean the video does suck like yeah it's I not guess, great i get yeah. what you're saying just, okay. just off of zoom yeah so the quality isn't the best yeah um 
Yeah, we can't even get above 720p as far as the final oh, product is concerned. That's embarrassing. Thanks. Thanks. Hey, man, it's sad, really. It's sad, especially for the fastest growing radio program in all San Francisco. Yeah, Tavis, I, but T.I., I need, yeah, we got to be calling into fucking radio. Uh, you know, we got to be calling it after. Well, I guess. I mean, what would you like me to call about? There's not, I mean, I have a Warriors playoffs there about to start. Like, I guess. Yeah, there's, there's not much. You know, right, there's not much to call. There's the not much NFL call. Slam. It's been kind of flat now, or am I, tra- or am I crazy? Like, great. There's been drama of, like, Rodgers and Lamar thing, but yeah. like, nothing's happening. Would the Niners aren't no, going I don't disagree with you. I don't disagree with you. I mean, yeah. I mean, the Niners are fucking good. The Niners are sick. So it's yeah. like as long as they figure out their quarterback situation, like that's pretty much the only thing. And they already have like oh turnover at least two. Hold so on, guys. It's more of a, guys, more in the health, more in the health seconds. situation. UCLA's down six. Mark Few, he's getting ready to drink and drive tonight. Wow, <laughs> just a careless turnover. Pre- Producer Reese, what are your what are your thoughts on the atmosphere at Rivers and? Uh, in in Stockton right now, are you are you are you okay? Yeah, I'm uh, trying to survive out here, but you know it's like yeah, I, I almost died today. You know, just staying inside here right now. Really? Yeah, like you know the wind Dang. the wind is pretty crazy right now. I hope that you know the roof doesn't get blown off my house and uh, oh, a tree yeah, fell yeah, yeah. on my neighbor's car. Dang, bro, smashed it completely. Dang, San Francisco. That's, that's crazy, nuts. But yeah, yeah. I live in Oakland. Oakland, Oakland. Yeah. Hey, how about uh, yeah? Are we going to your place, Tavis, on Sunday, or what's up? Yeah, man, Elite uh, Eight. Producer response in. Potentially. Potentially. That's a no. That's a yeah, no. That's a no. Probably hey, if you, if you and Producer Reese want to hang out on Sunday, you got to send me a picture. <laughs> 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 that would be awesome. Producer Reese and Tab just become best, they just become best buddies. <laughs> it's on the way. I would love that. I, it's close to the, yeah, I would like love 45, nothing. it's like 60 minutes away from me. Uh, I mean, it's, it's not that far from Producer East in the Central Valley, you know? No, man. Bring fucking Nick Diaz, Nick Diaz, bring one of the Diaz brothers. Slam ball. We got to cover some slam ball this summer. I would love to go down there in July. It's pretty, um, that, that is pretty cool, dude. That was. Producer East probably doesn't even remember slam ball. You were like, you weren't even born when slam ball was around. People would like break their legs. It was really fucking violent, dude. People would be like horrible injuries. I got to look this up. Is that right? Is that why they stopped it? I remember, yeah, it was about, dude, I do you was not, probably, you never, you can look up, I'm pretty sure it was like a leg break compilation. Like, dude, cause like guys <laughs> would just be fucking fine and they'd land and like break their legs and shit. Dang. It was like a dangerous <laughs> sport. Oh, incredibly dangerous. Yeah. I mean, it makes, it makes, dude, UCLA uh, is at that was, the line. That was the best. Shoot, we're at the line shooting and one Jaime Jaquez. We're about to be done. Jaime. We're about to be done. He's got oh, okay, 70. We're about oh to be shit. Done. If Dang. he makes this, he I'm made it. A game on. He made it. Wow, three point game. And they have they, they don't have to foul. They just got to play defense. They need to stop. Wow, I'm about to go live on this. Uh, Holy guacamole! We're about to do some some Trap. live play, why, play by play. Dude, why are you tweeting? fouling? What are you doing? Why would you foul there? But do they have a foul to give? Are they no. putting them on the line? No, they're, everyone's in a double bonus. Oh man, hate to see it. Play some defense here. Play some defense yeah. here. But what is the jo- the guy said right now? Like you're trying to extend the game, but like what's the logic? Let's say he makes both, then you have to score quick and be- like you literally had a chance to play defense, and get one stop, and then you get the ball back down three. I don't understand that. You get the ball back down three with Holy like yeah, ten seconds to go, ten twelve seconds. That's to go, a which is like pretty good. Yeah, dude, he just missed the first one though, so maybe I'm maybe I'm an idiot. They fouled their worst oh. player shooter, to be fair, I guess. Oh, okay, I don't hate that strategy. I'm a little bit behind on uh, the watch Oh, he missed it. Yeah, Brick. I guess my stream's a little bit behind. Sad. He missed the second one. Oh, he made oh. it. Oh, bounce. Oh, did he? Yeah, now you got to go fast. You got to go. You just see the two, too. You don't even need a three. There's, this is so bad. Oh, you got use the glass. He got it. I may. He got two it. right hand. Now you have to. Two right hand. 75, to, 73. That was a crazy bounce on the free throw. I just got a free throw. He beat the press. Two point game. Now you have to two foul. point game. West Coast Conference. UCD. This is this is this is for fucking supremacy on the western half of the United States. You realize that yeah. the West Coast Conference is like the redheaded stepchild of of basketball. They don't have the you know they don't have the so can the you, pomp, can, the, the pageantry, the banners of UCLA. UCLA has how many banners, producer? Is ten, ten plus? Yeah, like ten, more than that. Like ten, bro. Yeah. I think it's at least. I think it's maybe twelve. UCLA might be the most storied program in the history of college basketball. Well, Gonzaga is just the, the new kids. In, in your the power. Kids can you give me your top five program power ranking, then, please? I won't. I won't say a word until you're finished. But can you no or no <laughs> order, or you can go five to one. But I'm, I'm so I would it. say it's not necessarily a program power ranking, but That's it's like who what you were saying, has. But. Who has a who is coming in hot to the tournament? That's what that's no, that's all no, I'm saying. Like, who has a chance to really win it? No, that's Dan. what I'm saying. No, because you're why do you get that, Tavis? No, why? Because you, you you say you base it off fucking programs, but now you're you're like and you're like this year doesn't matter. But now you're taught if this year doesn't so India Indiana is a good example. You know that Indi- you know that Indiana is not going to win the tournament this year. You just know it. 
You know it going in. What is Indiana? That? Okay, I'm going to ask you. You're not going to answer any questions tonight. Which Indiana is like, a strong program, you but you know they're not going to win the fucking championship. Texas no, is a strong program. You know, you know they're what? not going to win the championship. Purdue, probably in recent years, I'd say has been better than Indiana. You were shitting on Purdue last week. So I'm going to ask you. I picked time. Purdue to win the Final Four. I didn't I'm think they were going to win the whole thing. I'm going I did not ask, think they were going to win the whole I'm thing. I'm going to ask you one more time. Please tell me your top five programs in college basketball. You have the floor. The floor is yours, Mr. Senator. There's a difference between who can win the tournament and who's a top five program. Reese. Is Duke a top five program? No. Yes. Reese. But are they going to win the tournament this year? No. Reese, did Dan not say you're focused more on this year? I'm talking more like, yeah, traditional program. Can we like we could probably clip that in at some point? Yeah, we'll have it's to rewind difficult it. to get old clips. Yeah, it's hard to do that. Because, you know, I, I get Sometimes it. But they like, disappear. Not, we always clip shit back in. Are you kidding me, dude? Producer Reese and I, I'm digging through the fucking, I'm, I'm digging through old footage all the time. Right, pull, up I, pull up what I said. Gonzaga at 40 to 1 was a great value bet to win the tournament. We put I, it I'm in the next episode, Thomas. I'm, I'm, that, yeah. I'm waiting. I'm waiting to hear your top five program of like whatever. This, I just give me the Dan O'Connor top five. That's what I'm looking you for. You put it in the last episode, Thomas. I, I, the fact I, that you I, have, you're, you're yeah. doubting that is shameful. You don't even have okay. your audio live. I'm asking you. I, again, I'm going to ask you one more time. The, the Dan O'Connor, like whatever this ranking system is that you have, I'd love to hear the top five in, in this ranking system. Timmy's my audio got messed up there. Timmy's a my, my, my audio got messed up. Okay, well, I, I'd, I'd love the Dan Timmy O'Connor. might be younger than me. Timmy might be younger, uh, I mean, older than me, I should say. He's, he's, um, I think he's my age. He, he missed the first might one. Be. He missed the first one. That's sad, man. He's a 63% free throw shooter. That's oh, terrible. Man, 63.7, really? yeah, you're right. That's I'd love awful. overtime. I'd I'd love overtime in this game, just for like I didn't bet on this, but just for like oh a, he wasn't even close on the first one, Tavis. That was embarrassing. Sad. Sheesh, Luis. Dude, look at these band members of UCLA. All right, let's see. He dude, I thought he was like a clutch guy. You got to make your free throws, man. Like this is front yard shit. Yeah, this is. Sad. If you're UCLA, do you shoot a three if he makes this one? I think you don't. I think you you just try and you get try and score a quick two. He missed both. Holy fucking shit. This is insane. That's that's his legacy right now. That's his legacy. Dude, go a little. Go for a fast two. Fast two, dummies. Bob Marley. No, don't fast shoot Fast two. Oh, oh, oh he made it. Gracious. Oh, my goodness. Holy oh, cannoli. wow, he made it. This is that a great is game. Wow. Wow. Oh, my goodness Whoa. gracious. Watch them win. Watch them win by one. The spread's one and a half. So. <laughs> this dude, Bailey, man. Wow, oh, I thought that's crazy, man. Guacamole. The Zags, man. That is, dude. If that is Timmy's last play, that is just embarrassing, man. Two missed free throws yeah. and two badly missed free throws. It's crazy how like wow. both teams have essentially epically collapsed in this game. I guess so. Hey, man. Okay, it's so West Coast basketball for you. Hey, maybe. Out. Can I please get the ranking of like the school, the Dan O'Connor like March Madness? I haven't watched a dribble of college basketball since two thousand and fucking eight. Power rankings, please. <laughs> the floor's yours. UConn. Okay. All right, so who's who's gonna win the tournament this no, year? Or no, who's no, gonna no, win no, the fucking? No, 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 no. Because Dan, you literally just said, I think of like who's gonna win it this year. You think more pro? You literally said that. So I'm holding your feet to the fire here. This is why we can't be rivals because you don't answer questions either. I answer questions. I answer them directly. I do that for a living. So I'm gonna ask you one more time. That's Dan true. O'Connor, I'm too. I'm too. I make I make things too fucking complicated. I'm not tactical enough. That's why we can't be rivals. It's sad. It's so, sad. Really. So UConn, you're a big UConn. It's a blessing guy. and a curse. UConn, 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 UConn times four. UConn times four. UConn, who else? I mean, for top programs, I would go with the Blue Bloods. I'd go with, uh, yeah, I'd go Kentucky, Duke. I can't go Kansas. I mean, yeah, I, I, you're, you're not, you're not, uh, you're not understanding the premise. My brain is on too many wavelengths above you, Tavis, no, to even Dan, have you understand you, I, I what I'm trying to say. We'll, 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 All I'm saying is that three of the four, when my team, when I get three of the four final four picks. Correct. Well, you and you're Miami. sitting around saying... You said Miami's going to lose tomorrow. No, I didn't. I had Miami winning. No, I had Miami in the Final Four. Yeah, but you said Houston's going to beat them. No, I did not. You no, did I did not, not say that? Okay, I'm fucked. I did not say that. They got Check the tape. Pass. Hold on. Step. Check the tape, producer. I'm back. just sick of... Like, this guy hasn't watched... This is the first time he's watched college basketball in fucking 14 years, and he's got all these opinions. <laughs> no way. Oh, man! <laughs> what is happening, T.I.? Oh my goodness, incredible shot. The WCC, the WCC takes on the Pac-12. Oh my goodness. The WCC is now the preeminent conference on the western half of the United States of America, producer Reese. We just saw history. 2023, we just saw history in the making. To not even get a shot off is a a disservice to all of us as fans. 
Oh my goodness. He just saved Drew Timmy's legacy. Drew Timmy, the 35-year-old playing, a man that I am jealous of. Maybe someday I will be in his shoes at 40. Incredible. Incredible from the Zags. Wow. Dude, UCLA is lost. Remember how they lost the other game to them? What did like, I tell you? Soon? What did I tell you, T.I.? My brain keeps just running laps uh, all I around you. I UCLA ain't going to win. What are you talking win. about? I can't, fucking, you win, can't give man. a fucking thing, dude. It's, it's unbelievably stupid. Machine said, and sometimes it's programs, other times it's not programs. There's just no rhyme or fucking reason to it, dude. It's fucking <laughs> that's insane. That's because my brain is just no, my brain shut is just circle, 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 up. circle, circle, shut circle, circle. I hope you do. Yeah, you probably want to miss this if you're smart. You you miss this because then you. How do you miss the front end there? I mean, uh, that's Rob Owens. I don't know. I, I'm I'm a few minutes behind. I'm, I'm a few seconds behind your streamer. So 1.1 seconds here. Yeah, I mean, do you miss it? I think you do. I, uh, yeah. Yeah, you miss it. You gotta like it. just just pass it to yourself off the front rim. Pass yeah. it, and then just like just start tipping it around. Yeah, you, you miss this if you're because the clock starts one. No, it's if you. When does it start or a miss? Is it? It, it, once the ball is touched, then I think yeah, so. Be, offensive, be, offensive defense. See, I think you miss it hard, hard, miss it hard off the front rim. So yeah. now they can throw it down and potentially yeah, get, a get a half, or an advance easier, the ball on a timeout, an or advance shot. the ball on timeout. They, they don't, they don't have a timeout. Have no timeout. All right, you got to shoot it, shoot it. Don't dribble it. Ooh, ooh. Did he even get it off? I couldn't yeah, tell on got, your screen. He, he got it off. Did he get? He dribbled it. Okay, they gave him one point four here. I'm gonna watch this. Is this is live on my screen? Yeah, that's crazy, man. I think you got a. I think you missed in that situation. That guy got then, yeah. Bailey got fucked for me. He got it shot. off. Hey, that was actually, yeah, that's, that's about right. That's a good play there. Hey, man, that's the old, uh, what is that, Valparaiso? Valparaiso from back in the day. Producer Reese, throw in the Valparaiso clip. All right, well, I got to go, Dan. Thanks for nothing tonight. I really appreciate it. I'm looking forward to hearing your actual ranking of teams of all the college basketball you want. Thanks so much. I gave you my final four Thank when you. I have three out of four Thank in you. there. Thank then you. I'll God be right everyone. and get, 